When your BabySense monitor won't turn on, power issues are the most common culprits. Let's systematically diagnose these problems step by step. First, ensure your monitor is adequately charged. A full charge can take up to eight hours, so if your device has been sitting unused, it may simply need more charging time. Next, carefully inspect your power adapter and cable for any visible damage. Look for frayed wires, bent connectors, or physical damage that could prevent proper power delivery. Try plugging your adapter into a different power outlet to rule out a faulty power source. You can test the outlet with another device or use a multimeter to verify it's working properly. If you have multiple BabySense cameras, try using the power adapter from another working camera with your problematic monitor. This helps isolate whether the issue is with the adapter or the monitor itself. If your monitor has been completely discharged, try a forced reboot. Connect the monitor to the charger and hold the power button for at least 30 seconds. This can sometimes jumpstart a dead battery by draining any residual power. These power diagnostics solve most BabySense monitor startup issues. Remember, adequate charging time, inspect all connections, test different power sources, and try the forced reboot technique when the battery appears completely dead. When basic power checks fail, advanced troubleshooting focuses on the internal battery system. First, we need to access the battery compartment, but be aware this may void your warranty. To access the battery, disconnect the unit from power, turn it upside down, and open the battery latch. Check for dust, debris, or loose connections inside the compartment. Disconnect the battery connector for about 30 seconds, then reconnect it. This can resolve connection issues. If the battery has degraded significantly, consider replacement with correct polarity. Next, try resetting the monitor. There are two types of resets, soft reset and hard reset. A soft reset is the gentler approach. For a hard reset or factory reset, locate the reset button often on the rear panel. Hold it down for five to 10 seconds, sometimes requiring a pin or paper clip. Additional troubleshooting includes checking screen brightness settings, cleaning the charging port, and ensuring proper device pairing without interference. Clean the charging port carefully with rubbing alcohol in an ear stick to remove any obstructions. Finally, ensure the baby and parent units are properly paired and check for interference from other electronic devices. 